What's up soldiers, your boy Chris here Vibes and Up in the Kitchen just came out from the fish market found some fresh sardines, really good price middle of winter so I really can't go outside, it is about minus 16 degrees uh -uh, I'm not going outside in a freezing cold typically I would grill this but we're doing it in the oven so we oven roasting it to, set, to get that sort of grill sort of nice roasted flavors out of it so we're doing some oven roasted sardines or grilled sardines you can do it on the grill let me vibes it up now man. I've got my sardines and six relatively big ones. Um, nothing to really boast about. But I went ahead and I cleaned them, I rinsed them and I washed them out with lemon juice and water. Sort of drained them dry. I sprinkled in some olive oil on the bottom of my roasting pan here. And I want to show you what I did here. A couple cuts on each of them in the belly on both sides because I want that marinade that we're about to do here to go and penetrate in there we're going to leave that to sit for about 15 minutes before we put it in the oven so next up we're going to go in with some salt and you can use sea salt you can use any sort of salt you like that is totally up to you some fresh ground black pepper and I have a bit more olive oil That's I'm just going to drizzle on the top a bit. I've got here two bird's eye pepper that I chopped up in sort of coarse. That's going to add some kick to it. I'm also going to go in later on with a couple of these whole ones. And these are the bird's eye pepper. You can use any sort of spicy pepper you like or you can leave it out altogether. It's totally up to you. Next up, it's all about the flavors, and I have here one scallion that I chopped up finely. Well, coarse again. Two cloves of garlic, and that garlic is going to give it some nice roasted flavors. And I have a couple tablespoons of roughly chopped parsley. Next up, we're going to go in with some lemon juice. And I'm just going to use my fingers to catch any of the seeds. See what I mean about catching the seeds? The other half of that lemon, I'm just gonna slice up and put in between here. Give that a good toss and let that marinate for about 10, 15 minutes or so before we get to ham, putting it into the oven. You will need to preheat your oven to 375, so 375 degrees Fahrenheit. So there we go, they're all seasoned. Marinating now, oven preheating, 375 degrees. And then we're gonna go in there for about anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes until they're fully cooked all the way through. It's been in the oven now for about 10 minutes. I want to give it that nice charred color and really intensify the flavors. So I'm gonna crank up the heat now to broil, which is 500 degrees Fahrenheit, I believe it is. Um, check, your, check your oven back in the oven for a few more minutes so there you go friends it took another four minutes under that broil setting perfectly done all that nice juices and oil on the bottom there you can serve this with just basic boiled potatoes or yam or dasheen or cassava whatever you want sardines i mean you see we usually reach for the stuff in the can in the caribbean but we have so much of that fresh fish available there's no reason why we shouldn't be doing this chris here caribbeanpod.com always a pleasure to have you guys here in the kitchen with me remember to hit subscribe hit like on the video below and you know what leave me some comments man i'm always reading them bless up